Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the walk around video of this 2011 11 registered Audi A6 Avant S-Line 2 litre TFSI turbo petrol example finished in the ever popular Daytona pearl grey it's covered just 123,645 Six speed petrol manual. Just three owners from you. And it's my job as Alex, the owner of Small Cars Direct, to present this car to you in a full and transparent way, talking through all of its features and its benefits naturally, but also talking through some of its imperfections as well. Just so you guys at home have the confidence to arrange a viewing by appointment or even, like many of our customers do these days arrange for nationwide delivery uh, at your convenience so just let us know your postcode we'll get you a price and uh, we'll arrange a mutually convenient day to get the vehicle delivered to your door so we just MOT'd it it's MOT'd uh, 11 miles ago so it comes with an MOT with no advisories to March 2023 you can see the paintwork is in fantastic order throughout. Just minor markings to note, which I'll uh, point out to you as I go around. Come to two keys. It's going to be serviced prior to sale as well. Being the S line, naturally, it comes with a good amount of specifications. So it comes with cruise control comes with sat nav, comes with leather, Milano leather upholstery throughout. Heated front seats as well, got the chrome line exterior trim, with the privacy glass, got the 18 inch alloy wheels, and all the tires have loads of tread remaining, I think. Pretty much new apart from maybe couple thousand miles worth of use so yeah great tyres headlights looking nice and clear got fog lights as well stone chips wise appreciate it's just started to drizzle which is unfortunate however the only I think I saw one stone chip which we've managed to touch in around here other than that it's remarkably clean considering it's covered 120,000 miles got a few light markings to the front bumper which you know now you can't you can't really see I mean you've got a few down here maybe like a small little mark there but what I'm picking out to you is the worst that you'll find even when it's you know, completely bone dry you know it's not going to suddenly spring out with a load of marks it really is that clean and presentable and we've got a few small marks on, just on the starch, that's a deep scratch. And there's another one there, but I think we'd actually be able to remove that one actually, just by polishing it. So it gives you a feel for its condition just by picking up the worst bits. This is probably the worst wheel with markings on this side. But again, you know, it's still presentable. And then you've got the nice chrome finish on the top of the bumper there. Number plate starting to uh, delaminate the bottom section this is obviously more than readable and um, these lights seem to have gone all cloudy I mean obviously still viewable in regards to being roadworthy and okay for the MOT still shining bright but still nevertheless just a you know a uh, an aesthetic thing and uh, that's about it really, you know, there's no large dents, there's no large scuffs down the vehicle. Let's take a look inside for you. The leather, leather upholstery, looking really nice. There's no tears, there's no holes to the seats at all. It's looking good. Obviously got ice effects. Centre armrest with a secret cubby hole. 
exactly what you'd expect really from a premium Audi. Ashtray for the, <laughs> for the passenger in the back. S-line and blazing door entry sills. I've noticed you can't actually gain access to passenger front door. The driver's got to provide access. That's possibly the only thing that I've noticed that isn't working. Everything else that we've tried and tested is. Got four electric windows, you've got electrically adjustable and heated wing mirrors. Got the S-line three spoke emblazoned leather steering wheel with multifunction. Let's take a look in the rear from this angle then. Carpet's looking nice and presentable as well. You've actually got a full size spare wheel, alloy wheel, which is rare. Jack, wheel, wrench, warning triangle, huge boot as you'd imagine, and I'll show you that shortly. It's fitted with the DSP audio system. I don't know what exactly that means but the audio system is very powerful i must say quite good quality auto lights now i must say it's listed according to audi on their own app and even on the data provided by auto trade it suggests that it's got cruise control but i don't actually think it has but it has got front heated seats, has got climate control, um, has got Bluetooth, center armrest, cup holder, locking wheel nut all present there. Looking for the glove box. No, it's here. There you go. That reveals your six CD auto changer. But yeah, it's all looking nice and clean in here. I'll show the engine bay as well. But why not start it whilst we're here? It starts fine, no hesitation. No untoward warning lights showing. Idling perfectly. And if you haven't already done so, guys, please do check out our reviews because we've got over 240 reviews now online and we've actually been highly rated by auto trader for four years in a row so yeah check out see what our customers have to say about us and finance can be arranged with rates starting from as little as 6.9 percent apr so really competitive rates of finance just get in touch if you wish to apply and we can arrange to have a link sent to email address and you can actually apply directly on the small cars direct website right now so you don't even need to speak to us you can just jump on our website and apply in your own time there's the nav maps showing phone here you can search finds bluetooth devices that way six speed manual gearbox Let's take a look at the engine, then I'll take a look at the huge boot, turning mission on. Yeah, take a look at the huge boot that it's got. And you can reserve this car right now from as little as £100. So please do get in touch um, if you wish to reserve it. I'd hate for you to miss out. Many people do miss out just by deliberating too long and somebody else has uh, already done that stage of things and actually bought it. So. Let me one of those people if you are interested in viewings are available by appointment six days a week and we can accommodate an evening viewing as well if you're traveling from far afield here's the engine bay looking pristine i believe it's 170 horsepower so ample amounts of power and the ride whilst i know you can't appreciate the ride virtually it's so smooth this car so smooth when you're out on the road it's quiet it's all sturdy 
everything that you'd expect, but just surprising considering the age and the mileage that it's covered that it still feels that smooth. Right, there we go. Let's check out the boot finally. Sun comes out now, typical. A wiper just sits slightly low, right on the edge, just to let you know. But I'll check its operation for you shortly. Huge, look at the size of that. I'll probably lie in that. It's got this like rubber floor underneath the standard floor. If I pull this up. Battery looks quite recent as well in here. And nice to see that it's a premium Bosch battery. There's your proper spare wheel. 18 inch, yep, 245. And the jack, warning triangle, wheel wrench, all in there. Parcel shelf cover, all working to hide your worldly goods away from any prying eyes. Oh, yeah, I was going to show you the rear wiper just to show you that it works. Okay, sitting in the rear view mirror there, operating. There we go. Got any questions? Please get in touch with myself, Alex, of Small Cars Direct. Really do hope the video's been of use. Many thanks for watching, and hopefully, I'll hear from you soon.